for many of us the gene or gram our family is a difficult thing to do and i want to commend you for your courage in doing this it's hard for me to talk about still the story of the israelites coming up out of slavery in egypt is a great picture for us they lived for 400 years of slavery they had other gods they lied they stole they coveted they worked seven days a week and although god had delivered them out of egypt egypt was still deep in them they were freed by grace but they still had their families way of doing life in their bones and so they had to be formed into god's new family so god gave them the ten commandments in the same way god gives us scripture we call this the work of discipleship and that's why it's so important that we become deeply aware of the commandments of our family most were never spoken but they are in us the principle is you cannot change what you are unaware of so look at the workbook and consider the sample of family commandments and you know we chose 10 very common ones for example look at our first commandment on money some of us were taught things like money is the best source of security the more money you have the more important you are or make lots of money to prove you made it and then look at the commandment of grief and loss how did your family do grieving since life is filled with losses from birth to the grave it's essential that as members of the new family of jesus we acknowledge our losses god uses our losses to meet us in ways we had never imagined